Most respected Mr. President, brother and sister, I would like to draw your attention on the caste-based violation of human rights in India, of which the Dalit and the minorities are the sufferers. Undereducated poor and discrimination against the Dalit are also exploited and looked down upon as second-class citizens, especially in rural areas of the country. Due to the great efforts of the honorable leadership of Dr. Baba Sahib, Vibram Ambedkar, who framed the Indian constitution, the Dalit were granted many rights, such as reservation of government job for the Sulukas, Sul tribes, and minority people. Nevertheless, in the private sector, the representation of Dalit is almost negligible, is there is no provision for the reservation there is especially because they are prevented from claiming up the social and economic ladder. Mr. President, we demand that the reservation policy must be implemented in the private sector as well as we demand the Reservation Act to be put up in the ninth schedule. Dalit and minorities should be given preference in the various government works, contracts, special scheme for the Dalit and minority living below the poverty line must be framed by the government. We also demanded the, the, the reservation policy in government job must be followed properly to provide opportunity to the Dalit and other minorities. The minimum wages act should be framed and implemented by the government. Because of poverty, Dalit and minority children who cannot afford expensive private school have to go to government school where the quality of education is poor. Cases of sexual harassment of the girl reported from the some government school must be stopped. We demand better quality education in such school and free hostel facility for these children. In addition, because of poverty, the Dalit do not have access to, to quality health care. We demand the, that Dalit and minorities must be provided uh, better health care assistance. We also demanded that the special component budget earmarked for the Dalit and minorities must be properly utilized in their welfare. Mr. President, we conclude we demand that the government should make every effort to the stop human rights violation, including rape, murder, torture against the Dalit and minority, as well as ensuring them proper and fair condition of life. Mr. President, I am indeed thankful to you for providing me opportunity to speak for this prestigious stage. Thank you.